Hi, I'm Tim, and welcome to Watch You Want. Thanks for logging on. Now, if there's one thing that I like more than watches, okay, there isn't. But if there's something that comes close, it would be cars. Now, I'm going to make a little confession here, lurking right off camera is my own JLC Amvox 2 right there, peeking in. But what we're looking at here is a union between two companies that share a border and share a language, because this is the IWC Ingenieur Automatic AMG Black Series Ceramic. Now, as it happens, the Swiss canton of Schaffhausen, home to IWC since 1868, and the German state of Baden-Württemberg share a border and a language. Baden-Württemberg is the home of AMG, or Aufrecht Melker Grosspach. No longer located in Grosspach, but in nearby a Falterbach, AMG is the, per the performance tuner par excellence, now in-house with Mercedes-Benz since 1967. Just about a century after IWC was founded, AMG has been building uncompromising modified bomber Benzes from the Hammer to the modern SLS AMG and beyond. AMG's thing is to take a stock product that's already excellent, refined, and superior and to make it better, hotter, more intense. And that's exactly what IWC and AMG have done with the AMG Black Series of the Ingenieur Automatic. Now, the two have actually been engaged in a partnership since 2004, and a series of Ingenieurs, one of the most technical and, quite honestly, engineering-oriented models, the ones that would uh, appeal equally to gearheads of watches and cars, have paid tribute to this relationship, but this is the latest, and this one brings a new wrinkle to the table, which is black ceramic. This watch is 46 millimeters in black ceramic, and the great thing about it is it'll hold its good looks. Ceramic is nearly indelible. As hard as sapphire, it's effectively scratch resistant, unless, let's face it, your wrist suffers some kind of blow that's going to pose more of a threat to flesh and blood than sapphire and ceramic. So for all practical intents and purposes, none of the old fears of scratching a PVD steel watch hold true for ceramic. It's black straight through and nearly unscratchable at that. Very hard, it also presents tremendously on the wrist. You can see the blacked out aesthetic of the watch. The lugs are virtually non-existent, which is why despite its 46 millimeter size, it actually wears much smaller. Now you have to realize that lug to lug, this is only about the size of a modern Submariner. So it's not gonna hula hoop around a smaller wrist. Mine is six and a third inches, 16 centimeters for reference. And you can see with this very flexible natural rubber strap, the watch gets a good purchase on the wrist without having to be clamped down to strangle you. Comfortable and ceramic doesn't weigh as much as steel. So it sits lightly, distributes its minimal weight nicely. The strap is very comfortable. It's also a combination of rubber and technical fiber. And I want to add that that combination of rubber and technical fiber is just the beginning of a strong and artful contrast that articulates this case. Although it is murdered out, all black, so to speak, it is not monotone. The watch has a lot of contrast between the polished ceramic of the bezel, which you can really see to advantage from this angle, and the matte tones of the case. There's variation. There's more of that as you transition between the rubber of the strap and the technical fiber of its tops. This continues on the dial itself, which is dished with an outboard 60 second, 60 minute track that slopes downward and inward to a biplanar dial, itself a beautiful gloss lacquer. It's got a shine to it that's complementary to the bezel and in contrast to the case. Everything about this watch, and heck, let's take it to its extreme, down to the black oxidized indexes and the black oxidized hands, is beautifully coordinated with just enough contrast to create that visual interest, that articulation, it's much like a big silver AMG Benz. At first glance, you see a mass of German racing silver, but it's the details that grab you. The vents, the flares, the body kit, the ground effects, everything that makes the AMG that much more dramatic, that articulates that mass of silver and turns it into something dynamic and alive that just holds your interest and intrigues your mind. That is what you find in the IWC Ingenieur Automatic AMG Black Series. And I should mention that the Black Series is the AMG line that is over and above. Much more bespoke, much more in tune with the idea of high horology and handmade high-end watches because the Black Series is not mass-produced. AMG today produces a full line of mass-produced tuned Mercedes and while they're special cars and lots of fun, the Black Series, which is built in their performance studio, 
harks back to what they were before they were owned by Benz, when everything was bespoke, everything was handmade, everything was hand-finished, and volumes were very, very low. That's more like the IWC, the high horology that I know. And the IWC Black Series Ceramic is really in tune, in sync with that kind of auto-building, watchmaking philosophy. Now inside the case, and I'm going to mention the case is the highlight, but inside the case, we'll take off this little sealed for your protection watch you want sticker on the back, you see the main event. This is the engine that powers the works here. This particular AMG is powered by an 80110 IWC manufacturer caliber automatic winding. This was designed to replace IWC's reliance on ETA 2892A2 movements, and it's got a leg up already. The sign of a true, competent manufacturer watchmaker is in addition to technical specification, the ability to build a movement to suit a case, the size of the case, the shape of the case, with no wasted geography, no clumsy spacers trying to make the movement look larger than it is, no artful use of a case to hide the fact that the one just wasn't designed for the other. This is a broad display back that shows you the full expanse of that 80,000 series movement, all of it designed for this kind of large modern sports watch. But that doesn't mean that it fails to pay tribute to tradition because it incorporates IWC's signature mid-century Peloton winding system designed in 1950 by Albert Peloton, their great watchmaker extraordinaire. It was phenomenally efficient, phenomenally progressive for the time. It's been copied by virtually everyone and it allows efficient bi-directional winding so you don't have that awkward freewheeling in either direction that you get from a system that winds in only one direction. This winds bi-directionally very efficiently and because of the bi-directional action there's no awkward wobble when the watch is on the wrist. A big balance wheel with a high moment of inertia provides excellent shock resistance. The watch is also gorgeously finished with a combination of Geneva waves, circular Geneva waves on the bridges and the blackened rotor itself, but also perlage on the base plate and a very subtle graining of some of the bridge elements associated with the Peloton system and the wheels located thereupon. This is a beautiful example of in-house watchmaking built to a rugged standard to suit a sports watch of a rugged character. This one can go on your wrist, it can go in the pool, it can go, as I like to say, to the business park or the water park. Very versatile. It's got a sleek aesthetic to it. And again, because it is surprisingly compatible with a smaller wrist and only 14.5 millimeters thick, this will play well with all but the tightest formal cuffs and sleeves. This is a very versatile, very attractive watch. And as versatile as it is, I've got to say that the ideal place for this particular IWC Ingenieur is on your wrist when your hand is on the wheel of an AMG Black Series. Whether you drive one, admire one, or you're just a fan of high performance machines, I would say that this IWC Ingenieur just might be the watch you want. And if that hasn't sealed the deal, I should mention that the watch is 100% complete and literally hot off the production line. Because this one was purchased in March of 2015. Think about that. When you purchase this watch, not only are you getting everything you would receive at the IWC factory boutique, but you're getting the balance of the IWC factory warranty to back it. And like I said, these are precision machines built to the highest standard by hand. You're unlikely to need it, but if you can have the whole package, if you can have something over and above, if you can have the Black Series, why wouldn't you? You can see this IWC Ingenieur Automatic AMG Black Series Ceramic Reference 322503, 46 millimeters, black ceramic, on our website, Watch You Want.